my name is Natalie Geiger. I'm from Greenville, South Carolina, and I'm a first year at the University of Chicago. I'm really excited to take you along with me for my day today. I think you saw me getting my breakfast ready, um, getting set up for the morning. So today we have a fairly busy day, even though I don't have too many classes. So I'm gonna start off and do a little bit of yoga just to kind of get ready. And then I'm going to my English uh, professor's office hours. So I'll meet with her to talk about some of my paper ideas for an upcoming assignment we have. I have a test in my music theory class. I'm going to the gym, there's milkshakes, it's a full day. So I will keep you updated as we go along, but just so you know what I'm doing for the next little bit, like I said, I'm gonna do some yoga and then at UChicago, we have what we call the core. So every first year is required to take an English class and so, or what we call Hume, what everyone else is called an English class. And so I'm gonna have office hours for that and then a music theory test, which hopefully shouldn't be too hard, but wish me luck and I'll meet up with you later. Okay, so I just got out of my music theory test. I think it went pretty well, let's hope. I'm taking just like a basic harmony and voice leading class. Like if you're in high school, it's kind of similar to like an AP music theory. But of course, since Chicago is more of an academic setting than a music school, it definitely is in more of like cultural implications and you know, just all of the complexities that we can get into with music. And then, so right now, since I finished that up, I am about to head out to the gym. It is the cold Chicago winter. So in order to get yourself moving, you know, kind of have to get out to the gym unless you want to brave the cold, but that's not me. So after that, I am gonna partake in you Chicago tradition of the $1 milkshake Wednesdays. So I'm gonna meet some friends, get some milkshakes. So I'll take you along with me and then I'll meet you back here. Okay, ignore my dirty mirror, but I'm bundled up and ready for the gym. Let's go. gym. I'm back from milkshakes with my friends. I am officially out of sweatpants and into real clothes. So I thought I'd fill you in a little bit about the rest of my day and just a little bit about a more general view of my life here at UChicago. So like I said earlier, I'm a first year and then I'm a sociology major and a music minor. So I've been playing violin for nine years and I fell in love with sociology, but I still want to do music. So incorporating that minor in and that kind of has uh, worked its way into my class schedule too. So at UChicago, even though we're a research institution, we also have to work through what's called our core, you know, just like your general variety, like sciences and English and math, work your way through all that. So I am taking my English class that I mentioned this morning, my music class, which is if anything, we have an arts requirement, but this is more helping me get started on my music minor. And then my other two classes are calculus to get through my math credit. And then I have my social, my social science, which again is required for the core, but I am a sociology major, social science major. So that's definitely one of my favorites, you know, studying populations and social theories. Yeah, so I am only taking four classes because at UChicago we have a quarter system instead of semesters. So we have three quarters during the year. There's a summer quarter, that's why it's three quarters. Um, but yeah, we're not in semesters. So we take less classes per quarter. So for some of those classes, since I didn't have any classes today, most of my classes are like Monday, Tuesday, and then Thursday and a couple on Friday. I do have a bunch of studying to get done. So I'm gonna go to Harper Reading Room. It's one of the old libraries, but now they just converted it to a reading room, which is absolutely stunning. My favorite place to go focus and get work done. And then I'm gonna come back from that. Let's see, I have orchestra tonight, which again, everything's virtual right now. So that'll be for my dorm room. And then I might go hang out with some people from my house when I have game night. At U Chicago, it's a big thing here that in your dorm, they put you into like a house, like you might've heard of in Harry Potter. And like, it's your first community here, like people who live and share a space with you. So yeah, we'll see how the rest of the night goes and I'll keep you updated.
so stopping to take a break for a second. I just got out of Harper. There was a massive snowstorm a couple days ago and I guess the roads are still kind of bad. So they closed early so everyone can get home while it's still light out. I ended up getting an impromptu biscuit and hot chocolate from one of my favorite local cafes. So catch up with you back at the dorm. I guess I'll finish studying there. Okay, so back at my dorm with my uh, mocha and then my biscuit. Again, I think I mentioned my studying got cut short because, you know, Harper, they decided to close it. So I guess I'm going to keep studying here. But the good news is they do have some practice rooms open in my dorm. So I might be able to get some practice time in. One of the good things about being at U Chicago is that I feel like my identity used to just be like in my original instrument, violin. And then now that I'm here and I'm taking music theory, I'm seeing how useful piano is. And I took piano lessons for a couple years in high school, but was never really that great at it. But I started picking it up again just as a hobby. And so that's really fun. Like it's a great way to rest and like remind myself how fun music can be. Like it's not just this thing that we like try really hard at and it's a career and it's this professional perfectionist thing. So I like bringing the fun back in music. So who knows, maybe I'll get some practicing done. I'll definitely keep you updated as I go. Okay y'all, I know I just filmed, but we just have to celebrate the little moments. So so I mentioned I went to the cafe to get my hot chocolate and biscuits. It's the best day of all days. They gave me two biscuits. One, two, when I only ordered one. So if that's a good sign of showing how one thing gets canceled, aka the library, another thing shows up just to brighten your day. Okay, cool. Let's get back to studying. room about to get some practicing done for a nice piano in the dorm i mean our music building has nicer practice rooms and everything but in covid times this is the one i can use for that rehearsing so yeah do a little bit of this and then time for dinner with some people and then orchestra <laughs> Okay, so I just got back from game night with my house. Before that, I was just practicing piano and then I got dinner with some friends. But Scrabble was great, a much needed break during the day. For the rest of the night, I'm really just studying, getting some reading done for class tomorrow. And then I have a FaceTime call with some people I'm on a group project with, but nothing exciting. So for now, I'm gonna sign off. It was so great taking you all along with me for my day in the life, if anything. It really just made me appreciate that I get to be here. Even if everything is virtual right now, you should have such a good fit for me academically and musically. So I'm glad y'all could kind of see what an average day looked like.